we're still at IDF 2014. We're at the uh, mobile garage, I think we're at now, and we're looking at um, a paint program running on the Surface Pro 3. Now, this is Coral Painter. It's due out in November. It's going to be priced at around $50, and uh, Intel tell me that they've actually worked with Coral to get it really well optimized for a touch experience, both docked and undocked. We'll, we'll look at the two user interfaces in a minute, but I just want to speak to Wager. Wager, is it? Yeah, she's Wager. from Intel, Hi. and she's also a painter on the side, so <laughs> Intel have a good one on their hands here. How, how are you getting on with this? How do you find it? Um, I find it amazing. Um, I personally use Painter you know, uh, as a hobby as well. So it's very amazing to work on the technical side, you know, kind of uh, be a part of that two-in-one influence and then, you know, getting the RTS support, uh, so it's pressure sensitive with the built-in stylus, uh, as well as doing a lot of the performance optimizations, because I do know a little bit about the pain points of these, you know, painting right, applications right. as a user. Um, and this is actually... So, I just, I just spotted this. Is this, what is this? This is what you use when you're at home, or...? Oh, yeah, this is what I used to use, actually, three or four years ago. I've had this actually since college, right? Um, right, so we got an absolutely massive, I think there's about four <laughs> kilos worth of kit here. Yeah. And you switch from that to the Service Pro 3, exactly. right? Yeah. So just show us a little bit about, you've got the digitized pen in your hand there. And um, obviously this has got uh, palm rejection, uh, pressure sensitivity, and um, all the features of Coral Painter there. This is the desktop mode. Let's switch to the tablet mode now. And you'll see when it goes, when it undocks, it switches to a different user interface. We've got a nice full screen. In fact, what we could do is hide the dock down there, get an even bigger screen. But that's a nice sort of on the go. Um, so you can still pick your brushes. Um, it's got yeah. full UI functionality. This is fully customizable as well. So you can put your favorite brushes on here. You can right. customize it however way you right. like. Um, yeah, is, that, is, is that going cool. over wide eye here to the screen? Yes, it is. All right, so <laughs> we even got wide eye wiring. demo. Yeah, it's fantastic. <laughs> All right, so that's a Coral Painter. Uh, going to be available November 2015. Yeah, there we go. Painter 2015. Optimized. Actually, this is um, the professional version. It's already right. launched in August. Oh, okay. So it's right. already out there. Um, but so there's a kind of like a, a, a amateur hobbyist version coming out in November for $50. All right, we'll check that out. Coral Painter here at IDF 2014. Thanks for watching.